Hey everybody, this is our week five video for our Dana and Tommy litter. Uh, we're in our little puppy playroom. I've kind of backed the space up a little bit so that you can see them and that they're not all over the place. But um, this is part of our socialization process. We get them in here with different different things, different textures. Uh, we have all kinds of different noises. So just, just kind of a little place where they can play and, and be little puppies, which I see you. I see you, Miss Pink. As you can see, they are really, their personalities have really, really, really come out a lot um, the past week and will continue to up until next week, which is why we wait until they're six weeks old before we do our picking process because, um, you know, two weeks ago, these guys weren't really doing much at all. But now, as you can tell, we are full speed ahead. We are loving life. We are just being so sweet. This is Mr. Red right here in my lap. Yes, yeah, sweet, sweet boy. But see, learning to climb up on things in a safe area where you know it's it's positive for them, it's fun. So um, kind of a kind of a cool place for them all to be. So a lot of this video, I'm just going to let you guys kind of watch. We do have the ribbons on them. I do tell people you see them scratching. It's just because they have the ribbon. It tickles them. They don't leave them on constantly. But I put the ribbon on so that you guys can see who is who. Uh, we've got right over here, I'll give you a rundown, we've got Miss Yellow, we've got Miss Light Blue right here, uh, we've got Mr. Green, Miss Orange, Sweet Miss Purple, Patiently Waiting, good girl. This is Miss White, I think I already said that, we have Miss Pink, uh, Miss Blue, we've got Mr. Red, Miss Gray, this is coming untied, and then big boy Mr. Black, come on! Come on, look at you. I'm already calling you and you're already coming. Hey, big guy. Show him this. Hey, Kevin. Yeah. Yeah, I'm the big man. The big man, aren't I? Yes, I am. I'm the big, big boy. Did I miss somebody? Is somebody behind me? I feel like somebody behind me. Oh, just Mr. Red. Why, well, how are you? Hey, Miss Blue. Um, but I'm going to do the same thing like I do every week. We'll, uh, we'll go over the weights. And I, I, we've kind of got it ranked right now of who is our most outgoing, who's kind of middle of the pack, and who's our most laid back. Um, this still can change before next week. Um, obviously, we'll have another video next week, and then we'll do our, our picking process. Miss Gray, are you going to bring Lamb Chop over here? You're going to bring her over here? Or another or litter mate? Yeah, she's about your size, isn't she? Miss Gray likes to play with the Lamb Chop. They, they seem to be more equivalent in, in size. But... Uh, but anyways, um, we have started on our, our puppy mush, so we take the puppy food and uh, blend it up, and they are loving it. You will tell by their weights that they are gaining weight. Yes, we are gaining weight. We are gaining weight. We are getting big. We are getting so big, even you, Miss Purple, over there. Um, but after, um, after six weeks, they will go to individual bowls. So I know I posted a picture where they're, they're sharing a bowl, um, once we're six weeks old, we do individual eating so that we don't have any food aggression or someone getting more food than someone else. So, um, right now that bowl is just for them learning to eat. They get nasty. They get all up in the food. Um, so that will, that will change. They're still nursing on Dana. They will until they're six weeks old. Um, and they're, she's doing really, really good. She's a great mama. Obviously, like I said last week, she's definitely getting a little tired of them, as you can imagine. They just attack and are ready to eat. Yes, we are. We just attack, don't we? Don't we, Miss Orange? Don't we? Yes. Oh, did you get jealous? Did you get jealous? I'm so sorry, Miss Gray. I'm so sorry. Did I, did I make you jealous? And we, we have someone going to the bathroom, which happens every video. It happens constantly. So I'll go ahead and clean that up while you guys get to get to watch the watch everybody play. Whoops, getting around here is not easy. Oh, it's not. Whoop. I'm glad these guys are active because, um, like I said, by the end of this video, they will probably be sound asleep. That's how we do it. We go, 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 and then we are out. We are out, out, out. Well, I thought you were done going to the bathroom. We're just going to have to watch everybody play while you finish up. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's see here. All right. So, 
I'm going to go over everybody's um, weight. And like I said, we have them, we have them categorized as either outgoing or um, middle of the pack or laid back. Obviously with our boys, um, there's not as, as big of a difference, but um, sorry, still cleaning up. That's just how the videos go. <laughs> but um, we uh, next week we'll post our video and then we will be in contact with first pick and we will go from there on our picking process. If you guys have any questions about any of the puppies, um, just ask me. I'll be more than happy to answer them. Hopefully these videos um, show you a lot of their little personalities and, and things that we're seeing. All right, guys, we're not gonna fall asleep, are we? Okay, Miss Grace said, no, ma'am, we are not. Hey, Miss Pink, hey, Mr. Black. All right, you ready to go first, Mr. Black? Are you ready to go first? Are you ready to go first, big boy? You ready? Don't wag your tail. Whatever you do, don't wag your tail. Mm -hmm. All right, so this is Mr. Black. Um, I know the lighting is not fantastic. I do apologize about that, but hopefully you guys can see. Uh, Mr. Black is still majorly our biggest boy, uh, big blocky boy. You can see his face right there. Um, he is 4.8 pounds. He is our most active boy. Um, just definitely outgoing, loves toys, which we talked about last week. Uh, a lot of their personalities stay the same as, as we described them last week. But So this week I want you guys to get just a good look at them. Scoot up a little bit. So this is Mr. Black, our biggest boy, our most outgoing boy, active, not shy, I love toys. Yes, I do. You got a little food on your face. You got a little food on your face. <laughs> hey, look at this chunk. Hey, we are doing so good with our socialization process and getting used to being handled. Bengals run, running through our gums. We have little teeth. Smile. Can you say cheese? This is why Dana is about tired of them. Yeah, we got teeth. All right, I'm going to let you down to play. So that's Mr. Black. All right, next in size for our boys sound asleep over here is our most laid back boy. Well, wakey wakey. So this is Mr. Green, um, our lightest coat boy, uh, most laid back boy. A big difference between, um, from him and, and, and Black. Black and gray are just very large puppies. So there's a big difference between all of them and their litter mates. Uh, Mr. Green is 2.8 pounds, lightest coat for our boys, very laid back, right on cue. There we go. See? There we go. Is that, that's, that's your mama. She's, oh, she's enjoying her, her day, her, well, not her day off, but her time off right now. So this is Mr. Green, 2.8, laid back boy. Oh, where are we going? Is everybody all around me? All right, now for our smallest boy. Uh, <laughs> what is it, Miss Gray? We're gonna play in just a minute. So we got a little bit of food on us. We did just eat just a few minutes ago. So, um, <laughs> Mr. Red is, uh, she is a busy girl. Mr. Red is 2.6 pounds, um, smallest boy. Uh, kind of right there in the middle of the pack. Um, yes, what are you, you still eating? You still got food in your mouth? What you got? What you got, big boy? So we just finished eating, we sure did. You're a sweet boy. Did you get a good look at him? Middle of the pack, Mr. Red. He loves attention. I know you guys probably noticed right when I sat down in the video, he was right in my lap. Um, that's his favorite place. He just he wants to be around people. See, I'm just a sweet guy. Yes, I am. Your typical golden retriever just wants a lot of love and a lot of attention. That's Mr. Red. Mm -hmm. Is it your turn, Miss Gray? Is it your turn? Oh, we got another one. So we got to clean that part up real fast. Miss Gray said, where did you go? Where did you go? 
So happy we do a video, and then we, we feed them, and then we do a video. All right. Um, where'd you go? There you are. There you are. Oh, you, this is driving you crazy. So this is Miss Gray, which she has basically showed you her personality throughout this video so far. She is our biggest puppy. She is, let's see, 5.2 pounds. Does not meet a stranger. Loves attention, loves toys. Definitely our most, one of our most active girls. Um, we've got three that we've got categorized as, as our active of the batch. Um, and that would definitely be Miss Gray. She has a super thick coat, the thickest coat of all the puppies. Um, she's gonna be a really blocky girl. We talk about it every week. She's just kind of built like the boys. Yes, but I'm just so cute. I'm so cute and I'm not scared of anything. She was over trying to get in the little ball pit. Um, they're not quite big enough yet to get in there. Give them about a week and they will be running through all of this. So our big mama, 5.2 pounds, outgoing girl, super active is Miss Gray. Yeah, don't look at me, look at the camera. Her and my son, um, they, uh, they have a lot of fun together. They are all over the place. Now everybody's getting sleepy on me now, I can see. All right, over here, chewing at my shoelaces. Oh, it's Miss White. What kind of day are we gonna have today, Miss White? Is it gonna be a good day? It's our bossy girl. Yes, I'm just full of personality. <laughs> Miss White is 4.2 pounds, so a whole pound smaller than our biggest girl, and she's our second in size. Just kind of shows you how big um, Miss Gray truly is. So this is Miss White. Miss White is also our active girl. No, I'm sorry, Miss White is our middle of the pack girl. I'm sorry, I'm getting you confused with orange. Yes, I am. Um, she's kind of right there in the middle of the pack, uh, more active than laid back, I guess you could say, but definitely not the same as, as Gray. She's got a really pretty coat as well, also gonna be a blocky girl, yes I am. We're gonna have a good day. We're gonna have a good day, Miss White. Yes, she runs the show. She is the bossy girl for sure. Tell them. Her personality cracks us up. I'm so funny. <laughs> if she doesn't like something, she will let you know. You didn't like that? No, you didn't like when I did that? <laughs> All right, next in size. It's going to be oh, right here. Miss Light Blue. Hello, sweet girl. Oh, you can tell you just woke up and you've got food on you too, yes. All right, so Miss Light Blue is 3.2 pounds. Um, still has one of the lightest coats of our females. Uh, that's stayed true throughout the whole five weeks now. Um, I do tell people, and I probably have already said it to you guys, you can tell their coat color, what color their coat will be by their color of their ears. Um, obviously now their ears are getting a little bit bigger so we can actually see. Good night, take yourself a little nap. Don't mind me. <laughs> um, but that's the darkest color that they will be when they're an adult. So, and Miss, oh, excuse me, good morning. You're on camera. You're on camera, you don't care. <laughs> so Miss Light Blue is, I should say she's one of our laid back, but she's really middle of the pack. She's just got a really full belly right now. Yes, I do. I got a little food on my ear too. Mm -hmm. So this is Miss Light Blue. Uh, 3.2, middle of the pack. Uh, really light colored coat girl. Super sleepy. Obviously a very go with the flow. <laughs> All right, you're, you're acting like, was that Mr. Red last week that was acting like this? You're acting just like him. I'm going to let you take a nap, okay? You tell him I'll see you next week. <laughs> All right. Now for one of our most active girls, or truly our most active girl, who is sound asleep as well. I was really hoping you guys would get to see her in action, which I think you got to see. Hello. Hello. Are you awake? <laughs> Uh, is Miss Orange. Miss Orange is definitely our most adventurous puppy out of all the puppies. Not scared of anything. She's 3.2 pounds. She's got a little, little food. Yeah. Put on you too. 
Okay. That's Miss White and Miss Gray still playing. Uh, but she is super outgoing. Uh, she will, she was the first to escape the whelping box. They're no longer in the whelping box. Um, obviously they're, they're too big for that now, but she, uh, she had no problem getting out of it. So yes, I got right out and was just hanging out with my mom on the other side, just having all the food that I could possibly want. Yes. So I am adventurous. I'm not scared of anything. I love toys and I'm sleepy now. You ready to go back to bed? So this is Miss Orange. Hey buddy. All right. Where are you? Down here at the bottom. Oh man. Hey pretty girl. Hey pretty girl. All right, Miss Yellow is our lightest coat female. Her and uh, Miss Light Blue have the lightest coats. Uh, Miss Yellow is 3.4 pounds, um, kind of very similar to Miss Light Blue. Um, but she's very, she's middle of the pack, um, you know, not the first to greet us when we walk in, but not really scared of anything. We're teething, aren't we? We're teething, yes we are. Just a sweet girl, kind of middle of the pack, right there, right there in the middle, aren't I? Yeah, a little food on our face. Um, one thing I do tell people, you know, when I show you there that she's teething. So when you get your puppy, uh, it's very important that you correct any behaviors that you would not want a 60, 70, 80 pound dog to be doing. So if, if your puppy jumps up on you and you pick them up and you're, oh, that's cute. And you hold them close. They feel like they're being rewarded for that behavior. So make sure that whatever you reward or give them attention or pet or act excited about is something that you would be okay with your um, full grown dog doing. And that's important for uh, children too. I mean, you're, 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 if you have a young child and you know the, the puppy's jumping up on them and they're just laughing and playing with them and then praising them, then they're gonna learn that, oh, I jump up on the little kid and I get a lot of attention. So um, it's just something that you wanna be mindful of and, and keep keep them on the right track from the time they come home. So that's our lesson for uh, Miss Yellow teething on my finger. Yes, it is. Because we are definitely going to be teething. All right. Miss Blue, where are you Miss Blue? Oh, she's got her arm on her. Oh, sorry Miss. All right, so Miss Blue is one of our more active. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> she's the same as orange. I'm awake, I'm awake. Miss Blue is one of our more, more active females. She is three pounds. Uh, she loves toys. She just loves people. We walk in the door. She's first to, right there to greet us. She's just super excited. Um, just a joyful, joyful puppy. Really not scared of anything. She's very similar to Orange. She's not as outgoing as Orange, but very similar. Look at you, Mr. Red. Be adventurous over there. Teaches them to climb up on new things. That's too funny. Well, come on down. You'll grow into it. <laughs> All right, sorry. So that is Miss Blue. She has a light colored coat too. Oh, I know. So our more active girl, three pounds. All right, now to our laid back girls. Look at Miss White. I don't know if you can zoom in and see, but she's a... She's got her arm around Miss Green. Oh, never mind. <laughs> That's why I tell you get the lamb chop because this is about how they, they sleep right on top of each other all the time. All right. I don't know if the lighting is going to be better that way. Um, all right. So this is Miss Pink. She is 2.6 pounds. She is laid back. Um, she just, her and purple are very, very similar. So I'm going to be saying about the same things for both of them. Um, they just love to be close to me. They're very patient. Um, they're, they're sitting and waiting their turn on a lot of things, which is um, probably why they did turn out to be the smaller just in the beginning nursing. They weren't as aggressive to push the others out of the way to get milk, uh, but um, just super sweet, laid back, easygoing girls. Gonna be on the smaller side. So I just got a smaller frame. Yes, I do. So this is Miss Pink. Sound asleep. You can tell they're used to being handled. It doesn't phase them one bit. 
I think you're smiling. I don't know if you can see. It looks like she's smiling. Right. Now for our smallest girl, which in the beginning of the video, you might have noticed she was literally just sitting and waiting and staring at me. Um, is Miss Purple. She is so sweet. Slightly spoiled, just a little bit. Um, she is 2.4 pounds, so definitely going to be a petite girl. You look at her, her paws right there. I'm just going to be a smaller girl, but I'm super sweet. I'm very, very, very laid back, easygoing, um, just eager to please girl. She just feels like she's constantly looking at us like, what, what can I do to, to make you happy? Yes, I'm just a sweet little girl. So that's Miss Purple, our smallest puppy, 2.4 pounds. And everyone's back asleep. <laughs> this is how it goes. We go, 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 and then we crash. All right, come on, guys. Who's <laughs> awake? Hello, Miss Gray. Hello. Hello, Miss Yellow. Now's the time where I wake you all up and you all just come tackle me, right? Well, one of you did well in school. No, 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 we don't jump. Come on, guys. Hey, wake up. They want to see you in action. What are you doing? I was hoping we'd get them up a little bit and let you guys see them, see them play just a little bit more. Uh, of course, we got next week's video. You are a mess. You are a mess. But maybe you can see them. Come here, Mr. Black. Come on. Come on, big guy. Come on. Nobody wants to play. Are we that tired? We have full bellies. You can look at the difference between, where are you, Miss Gray? Our biggest puppy and our, our smallest puppy. We've got Miss Gray right here and Miss Purple right here. So a big difference. Super laid back, Miss Purple. Super outgoing, Miss Gray. Uh, but uh, if you guys have any questions, um, just let me know. I will be happy to answer them. Um, we are growing. We're getting bigger. Uh, we, like I say every week, we're, we're right on track with all of our little puppy milestones that we should be hitting. Yeah. Yeah, we are. We'll go next week for our shots, microchips. Um, before they go home, I'll give you their, their pup, I'll go over their puppy packet and explain all that to you guys. Um, you look so sad because I'm giving someone else attention. You just won't be there. See, I get so jealous. Yes, I do. Okay. I'll hold you, you big teddy bear. You big teddy bear. Um, but uh, hopefully you guys saw the supply list that I posted. If not, it was below last week's video. Hey, you trying to eat my hair? Uh, if you have any questions about it, let me know. And this will pretty much wrap up our week five video. I think they all end the same. Every litter we have, every video, they end with everyone sound asleep because we just play so hard and then we are out, out, out. Uh, so we will see you guys back here for our week six video next week.